though. So he doesn't take advantage, misses the black, and leaves a red on for Neil Robertson, who will be relieved to be coming back to the table and not losing a frame off those snooker escapes. Just left this awkward. He needs the rest for the black. Twenty five. It's a nice little shot. Pretty much every red's going to pop, you would think, in, in order here. So Robertson, despite that mishap at the start when he was snookered, fluke snookered, let's be honest, behind the green, he's got every chance now to take this opening frame. He needs points on the board. He's only got one from three. That's not anywhere near fatal, though, because if he can win a couple of matches, maybe all three today, then we'll see him in the playoffs again. Of course, he was runner-up put earlier this week in Group 3. He was a semi-finalist this time last week in Group 2. Anthony McGill did win there. Chris Mark Davis in the Group 3 final with that maximum break, that 147 in the decided frame. Thirty-four. 
150. Because of all the fouls, he's only 17 in front, despite being on a 51 break, but the important thing for Robertson is he's still going strong. Twenty eight the lead. So getting closer. Two reds, two blacks would do it. Sixty three. It's turned into such a great break builder. We always talk about three years ago when he made the hundred and three centuries in a single season, the first player to make a hundred in a season and who knows? Will be the second, will there ever be a second? Even if there is, you know Robertson was the first. Must get on a red here. Played a little cannon. It's worked out well. He's on the red to the left corner. And as I say, if, if he plays for the black, then Murphy's going to need a snooker because it'll be 44 behind with 43 on. 71. Murphy had a chance after being left a red when Robertson finally escaped from that snooker, left one on. He only made nine, 79. Murphy broke down almost immediately and Robertson has been pretty ruthless here in taking full advantage of that slip up. He'd be well aware that he needs points on the board today. 86. He's got this match, he stays on to play Karen Wilson and then he's back later against Mark Allen who is currently his bottom of the group. Murphy. 87. Also has three matches today, plays Ryan Day and Mark Williams later. Williams is actually in the last match of the group. Ninety-two. So a century is looking likely. Ninety-four. Robertson creeping up towards five hundred for his career. for the century. Well, flawless break this, just a great break, never been in trouble once, controlled the cue ball really well, 
Neil Robertson dishes up with 119. That is the way to start the morning here in Coventry. Fantastic break from the Australian. Really punished the Sean Murphy error. And he looks bang up for this today. Concentration was immaculate as well. And uh, just a classy break. So he leads 1-0 already. There's the final black going in. Job done for this frame.